Today is March 1st. This is a day when all of us look forward to winter's end, to warmth, sunshine, growing grass and flowers, a new beginning. My name is Michael Kerper, and today I'm asking you to begin a journey with me and my family. In 1983, Gail Gorin passed away from AML, acute myelogenous leukemia. Gail Gorin was a wife, mother, homemaker, student, and supporter of the arts and music. She battled her disease bravely for four long years, a battle that included incredible pain and sickness from the drugs, but always gave her hope and gave her time with her children. My wife Jody is one of Gail Gorin's four children. On the 20th anniversary of her passing in 2003, Jody and I organized the Gail Gorin Memorial Turkey Trot, a 5K and one mile fun run in our hometown of Smithtown, New York to benefit the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society. The run was a huge success. Last Thanksgiving was the eighth annual Gail Gorin Memorial Turkey Trot. In those eight years, we have raised hundreds of thousands of dollars and created what is now a tradition in our town with over 500 participants last year. For all of her dedication and hard work, the Long Island chapter of the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society has nominated Jody to be Woman of the Year. Our family couldn't be more proud and more excited. Our effort is a team effort. The name of our team is Gail's Girl. The Leukemia and Lymphoma Society is a worldwide organization. Their staff works every day to improve the lives of patients and their families, to provide research facilities, to develop new medications such as Gleevec, the now famous cancer drug, which targets only the cancerous cells while leaving the healthy cells untouched. This was done with dollars that we helped to raise. Our fight is not nearly over. Yes, there have been great strides in beating blood cancers and blood disorders in children and adults alike, but people are still dying. How many of you know someone who has passed from cancer? Not just leukemia, lymphoma, or Hodgkin's disease, but any cancer. All cancer research starts with the blood. This is our time to help. Our campaign is special in so many ways. First and foremost, there is relatively little cost. Well over 90% and probably as high as 97% of all the monies we raise will go directly to patients' care, families of patients, and research. Our campaign is also special in that it is honoring several caring individuals like Jody, recognizing them for their outstanding efforts. More importantly, it will allow us to develop cures. The treatment for AML is the same today as it was in 1983. That is not acceptable to us, and it shouldn't be to you. This is why you need to support Gail's Girl. Here's what I want you to do right now. Get a pen and paper. Don't worry, we'll wait. You can pause the video. You need to forward this link to everyone. Forward it in your Facebook, in your Twitter, in your MySpace, your LinkedIn, whatever social network you happen to be a part of. As they tell me, let's go viral. Not in a bad way, but don't forget to email it to everyone. On the bottom of this page, you see a link. Write it down. This is Jody's link. It goes right to her website. Go to li.mwoy.llsevent.org slash galesgirl. Write this address down now. Pull out your credit card right now. Don't wait. If you wait, you'll forget. Please give one dollar, five dollars, ten, a hundred, whatever you can afford. It's all tax deductible. Please do this now. If this goes viral with your help, Let's get a million viewers to give $1 or $5. That will save patients and their families today and in the future. Tell us your story. Let us know your story. Email your story to me at mkerper at msn.com. In the subject, please put Gail's Girl so I'll know who it is. Long or short, we will read them all. We will share them all. Any type of cancer, we are in this for everyone. Join the Gales Girl team. Help us to help others. Together, we can eliminate these horrible diseases. Together, we can and will make a difference. Go to Gales Girl now. We thank you in advance for your generosity and your support. God bless you all.